propane made me its bitch today. Yeah. I'm not, not proud to admit it, but, oh, I didn't think I was going to run out quite yet, I thought I had another day left in it, and, uh, you know, partially I should have filled up over the weekend, but, I mean, I was really busy being as lazy of a guy as I really could. I just really had to sit around and do nothing all weekend. It was just one of those kinds of weekends, and so... Man, I just, I just ran out. I woke up this morning, looked at my fridge, and both lights were on, so, you know, it wasn't lit anymore. I was like, what the heck, what happened there? And so I clicked the button a couple times, and then I came over here and clicked on my LP gas, and it was completely empty. And I was like, oh crap, could it really be out? Because, I mean, last time I checked, it was at like half a gal, or half a tank, so... I went to Chevron first because it was close to where I was at, and they wanted $2.99 a gallon. And oh my gosh. I mean, I'm used to paying, you know, below two bucks. I mean, I've been paying $1.50 per gallon at some places even. And so I was like, you know what? I'm going to try to find somewhere else. And so I went down the street, and you know, I mean, gas stations are just not good for the price of propane. They charge, you know, whatever they want. Down here, Ace Hardware, you know, hardware stores, they, when they have propane, they're typically better prices. The, the RV shop, they have a better price for propane. They say they have the best price in town, but they really don't. Um, but yeah, so I found a 76 that had propane for $2.50 a gallon if you used a card, or $2.39 $2 if you paid cash. And oh my gosh. Um, over 10 gallons, and so I paid 27 bucks. Ah, it's just ridiculous. 27 bucks to fill this thing up with propane. Man, I am used to it being half of that. It's not a good feeling getting, you know, made like that, but I mean, I was in a pinch, and I mean, heck, it's, it's 9.03 right now, and the boat is leaving port at 9.30. I'm just g getting my lunch all thrown together, and... Yeah, get my lunch all thrown together, and then I am going to get out of here and get get on the boat, get all the rest of the way ready to go. But I hope you guys are having a fabulous morning. Don't go to gas stations for propane. Stock up ahead of time. Well, stock up. You know what I mean. Get propane when uh, when you're not completely empty. Because <laughs> I mean, I couldn't let my fridge be you know, off all day. I got a ton of shit in it right now. I mean, come on. It is just full and I do not want to, you know, have any of my food, you know, get thawed out or anything. I mean, heck, it's at six uh, degrees Fahrenheit right now. I mean, last night it was at like negative six, maybe even negative nine. I can't remember. It was low. But yeah, got propane now. So at least, you know, at least I was able to get it. And, you know, I mean, if I had slept in, hit the snooze button a couple times, that wouldn't have been a good situation, because then I would have been like, really, oh crap, what am I gonna do now? You know, I mean, I can't miss the boat, obviously. But, uh, yeah, have a great day out there. Talk to you later, bye.